Hello everybody, welcome back to a new video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the new Lego Harry Potter um, books that have uh, revealed today. And so these were rumored for a while, we got some leaks and stuff. And basically you have um, books for a bunch of different classes. You have charms, herbology, um, potions, as well as transfiguration. So, each of these are called Hogwarts Moment, that's like the, uh, theme, the sub-theme, I guess, is Hogwarts Moment. So you have the Transfiguration, Potion, Herbology, and Charms, and they each are like one of the houses. You have the four houses, and the best part about these are definitely the minifigures, because, um, all of them have new, um, and exclusive stuff. Um, in my opinion, the best class out of all of them is the Transfiguration. Um, I think overall the book, um, the inside, the actual class looks the best. Plus you have the amazing new McGonagall with the dress piece and the hair and hat combo. And it seems to be the um, same face, except this one has glasses. So if you have the Great Hall, you have the same faces um, that this one has, except without the glasses. So I think that's really cool. I also hope we get to see um, uh, a hair piece for her sometime in the future. That would also be um, really cool to see. All of the uh, students in this set have a new um, uh, sweater because this one has the crest on it and the original did not. And so we have Gryffindor, Slytherin, and Ravenclaw, but we do not have a Hufflepuff of this one, unfortunately, because... The Hufflepuff, you know, book, um, you have, uh, Cedric and Neville, and both of them are in their outfits for Herbology and not their school uniform. So, unfortunately, we don't have, um, a Hufflepuff of this new design. These will be coming out January 1st of 2021, and they'll be $30 each. And the pieces range from like $230 to like $280, somewhere around there, like in between. And so, yeah, those are pretty much it for every, all the details. Um, the Ravenclaw class, you get Flitwick, and that one comes with Harry and Cho. And even though we don't see her in these years, it's always um, cool to get a new minifigure. So this is... Um, a younger version of Cho. We have not gotten that, mainly because we never actually see that, but still interesting. Um, I'm a little disappointed with Snape. He has been upgraded from the one um, in 2018 um, with the torso print, but I still do not like that face. Um, the best face is still that um, 2007 set um, for the Order of the Phoenix. That is still the best one. And I wish he came with a cape, or maybe even the new cloth piece that Kingsley came with in black. That would have probably fit. Um, but a cape or something, I feel, is needed here. Um, and that class is really cool, too. Uh, these seem to have a lot of stickers. I don't think any of these are going to be prints. So get ready to put on a bunch of stickers. Um, there's a lot of uh, accessories and stuff. Um, it kind of reminds me of the advent calendars. You have um, just a bunch of accessories laying around, really not going anywhere, which is fine and everything, but it's going to be hard to keep everything together. I think the one that is the most disappointing is the herbology class. The Professor Sprout looks really weird with those actual legs, and unfortunately, I thought we were going to be getting new um, molds for the hair and earmuffs combo, but instead you have the earmuffs around their neck, which is unfortunate, and the classroom itself just looks a little off, so I think the herbology one is one that you may want to skip because there's not uh, there's not really any good minifigures, it's just if you want to have them all is really the only reason that you would get this. If I'm not mistaken, we'll be getting more um, themes revealed for January or February and all that stuff for next year. So hopefully Star Wars will be coming later this week as well. So that's pretty much it. I will see you guys in the next video.